revolutionized a comedic instrument called a banjo, a kind of a minstrel instrument. To me, as to many other people, that was a revolutionary thing in banjo playing, son. So other people had done it, but not as aptly as Earl did. Earl put it into a package that was so um, just stunning. Nobody was doing that before. All those things that he came up with, and he came up with a whole vocabulary of idiomatic banjo stuff that um, is, uh, you know, created the book for every every banjo player to. Back then, I was going to leave. Bill was traveling so much, and I was getting a little bit tired. Of During that time, Lester decided he's going to quit too. So when I walked out from the opera that night, Lester turned in his notice. A few days after that, Lester gave me a call and he said, uh, you know, uh, we both might get unhappy going back into the factory after enjoying the music so much. So that's when we... For several years, Bill Monroe tried to prevent Flatt and Scruggs from joining the Grand Ole Opry. 